that we're seeing a gap. Um, we're seeing a gap between uh, sustainability promises and current corporate practices. And that's kind of what we're talking about here. And it's interesting why that's happening. And it's interesting how they're behaving. So obviously, it wasn't that important for them to have renewables in place. It was probably important to them to have a good PR effort out there that, hey, look, you know, we understand that we need to reduce our carbon footprint and, you know, look at how innovative we are and, you know, having wind and solar energy that's that's powering a few of our data centers. And everybody was making a big deal out of that and still are, by the way. So there's still organizations out there that are pushing the renewables that they use. But if you look at the data, if they're willing to show it to you, it's so minuscule in terms of their overall power consumption and certainly how their power consumption needs to scale up as the use of AI is growing over the next few years, that it's making no difference. And so they saw the writing on the wall. Environmental groups and the public are raising concerns about, you know, AI's impact on corporate climate uh, commitments. And I think that uh, I I can go ahead and make the statement. Um, It's my own assertion, by the way, Generally speaking, um, I don't think the renewable efforts that many of the high tech companies were were in right now, most companies were in right now, were sustainable long term. They just didn't have the science behind it. They couldn't produce the capacity that was going to make any difference. And I think they figured that out, you know, here in 2025. And so that's why you see a lack of interest in it now. So while they're still probably touting the use of renewables um, and, you know, minus atomic energy, you know, that's going to have the lowest carbon outprint of the way in which you generate power now. Um, they understand that it's not going to get them where you need to go. And again, they have to, you know, um, basically make a quiet shift.